everyone, welcome back to another one. Oh, I'm excited if you can't tell. I'm hollering and yelling everywhere and oh boy, look at that new shirt you got on there. My Dude, goodness. I can't help but wear it, it's so comfy. I know. I know you guys noticed this hat. I know. <laughs> like, I know. <laughs> what in the world do you have on your Oh, uh, this is the new bucket hat from Ducks. Our fall merch just dropped and uh, I'm gonna link it all down in the description. We got new hats, we got new shirts, we got new gear, we got calls, we got new seasoning. Jordan knows all about seasoning. It's good stuff, wild game seasoning. I'll link it all down in the description below. What do you have going on right here? That's the old U20. The U20, yeah, semi-auto 20. It doesn't fit me, so it's gonna embarrass me, but I'm gonna try it. Mmm, that looks pretty sharp. Well, I'm doing something about the same check out my rig today pretty excited whenever i get to use this gun i'm always pumped this is the first shotgun i ever owned uh if you're new to the channel and you haven't seen me use my single shot bolt action 410 well here she is in all of her glory it is a stevens model 59a there you go bolt action 410 the last hunt i did with this was a snow goose hunt and uh, we crushed it. It was amazing. This gun is a chokeless gun. Look at all these doves hitting the field. Holy smokes. Well, that ain't nothing. And it patterns amazing. I'm very excited to use it on today's dove hunt. Y'all have been recommending that I use the single shot 410 very soon. Well, here we are. We're doing it. By the way, if you guys have any, yo, if you guys have any video recommendations, uh, I don't know who that was that just pulled into the field. If you have any video recommendations, drop a comment down below and let me know what you want me to do. Well, here we go. Oh, we just got done walking in here. There are a ton, and I mean a ton of doves here. There's also probably about a hundred pigeons. Come on, Fred, here. Morning dove, tons of Eurasian dove. This is a cut sunflower fill this is my first time ever really hunting a good cut sunflower field y'all this is fire there are birds everywhere i'm gonna have to hurry up and get set up here because oh i'm gonna miss some all right i'm using some federal 410 this is 11 16th ounce seven and a half shot again guys just a single shot 410 here old bolt action girl oh yeah here we go I love this gun, dude. I love it. It's it's very unique. It's a dude. It's so small that she just saddles up there and I go. Well, this was there ain't that much recoil. It's more like <laughs> yeah. Eh. It's like <laughs> just a little fart, literally. But we're here with the bearded man himself, Jordan. Y'all know him. Y'all know him. I don't have to give a huge introduction. Seriously, if you haven't checked out Jordan's channel, you need to. He's got a literally a combination of different hunting big hey one of his main things is trapping if you are a trapper any trapping go subscribe to his channel now because or after the video whatever you'd like to do because you're gonna learn something from the guy i'm serious but uh i did bring some stakes and a leash in case i need to leash fred down i'm gonna try to go without it just by using the collar if he tries to break i got the collar on correctly two fingers i eh, might need to tighten it a little bit um but if he tries to break i'm just going to hit him with the collar see if i can get him stationed you know uh without the uh without the leash first so we're gonna have to go back to the truck and get you some water here real soon dude oh god <laughs> where did he come top. from wow dude, there's nowhere there's birds everywhere oh yeah just wait till they get up and move though Holy. like we haven't seen anything yet right when we shoot you said it's gonna get gnarly all of a sudden stuff starts moving then you start seeing a lot of birds. <laughs> well, there we go. I uh, I hit him. I puffed the, the butt right off of him. And Fred did not break. That was gorgeous. Fred did not break. Uh, Jordan backed me up and good down boy. that bird. Good boy! Good Fred! That's a good boy! Not a dog, no breaking. I loved it. I didn't get the GoPro on in time, but I think I, here, heel. Nope, 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 heel, right here. Right here, heel. Drop. There you go. Oh, thank you. First bird down. I hit him. You hit him? There's no question. There's feathers that flew. Man. Just, I, you were just a little bit behind him, though. Yep, yep, yep. I'm very happy. Frederick did not break. And I shot, 
everything. The collar. The collar. He got collar conditioned in training, y'all, and it it did the trick. Here we go. Another single. Set. Ooh, right here. Oh, I missed him completely. Fresh. Good dog. Missed him completely. <laughs> oh, missed another one. Good boy here, Fred. Good. This is perfect for him, dude. Oh, yeah. This is perfect. Good boy here. Come on, buddy. And if he can mark Dove, he'll yes, mark Yes, exactly. Here, here, here. nope. Heel. Heel. Fred, right here. Set. Drop. Oh, look at them all get up. There you go. Look at all the Dove over oh, there. Oh, my. Really about 50 Good job, there. Frederick. That is awesome. There's two. Y'all gotta smash that thumbs up for Frederick. Not for my shooting, but for Frederick. Um, he's doing awesome. I am very pleased. Let's get this video. What do you say? 3,500. 3,500? 3,500 3, 3, likes. Come on, y'all. Me and Preston uh, told him if they get 5,000 likes, that we'll do a 10 mojo hunt. 10 duck mojo. 10 duck mojo. Yeah, a teal hunt for with 10 mojos. You're, <laughs> we need your help, obviously, because it's going to have to be a public hunt, and we're going to have to tow all those mojos in because it's at like 5,700 likes. Oh, no. Yeah. It got <laughs> there in 24 hours. Oh, wow. <laughs> On the left here up front. Oh, two more. Man, there's a lot of birds here, y'all. Good lordy. You weren't kidding about sunflowers. Yeah, that's where it's at. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Oh, I can't pull the trigger. Oh. They are moving. I did not pull the trigger. No bird. Set. Wow. Good thing I brought a lot of ammo for this. So here, single shot. <laughs> Been if I had a 12 gauge, I mean, I'd oh. be, I'd have six on the ground so far. <laughs> it would be a little unfair. But they should see that mojo just fine. Yeah. I don't know why they're not. Oh there. my goodness. What the? <laughs> These feathers are just all in. Here, let me help. Let me see, buddy. You got to get the feathers out of their mouth, man. But <laughs> Jordan's on the board. Three birds. I can't hit anything today, man. It's difficult. I don't know what's going on. Hopefully I can... Sharpen up here. Get in here. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Man, these birds. When we first sat down, we were having them decoy on the mojo. Now, they are staying away from the mojo. Hopefully, uh, as the evening progresses here, they get a little more vulnerable than they want to land with that mojo a little more. But, 410 has been a challenge thus far. But, I'm not giving up. I'm going to make it happen. Well, I just helped with a pigeon. Me and Jordan just tackled that pigeon together. I hope I got it on shot cam. Good set. I, I, I don't know if it's mine. Here. We both went bloop. Plus, you're right under it. About shot straight up, but that's a hard shot. I cannot connect. I don't know if it's just so close and the pattern's that tight. I don't know. I just cannot connect. My first shot of the day, I puffed the first one and I have yet to do anything. Good boy. Here, Frederick. Let's go. Here. There we go. Good boy. Come on, buddy. Here. Let's go. Look, he's taking his time now through them <laughs> stocks. I was worried about that. Come on, buddy. Bring me my bird. That's my first one. Set. Set. Drop. Good boy. Right in front. I'm not loaded. That's all you, buddy. There we go. Finally. Got one down with the 410. Finally. Finally, finally, finally. Made it happen. He decoyed perfectly. Fred did not break. That was a perfect situation. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it. That was awesome, though. Now that I've connected once with the 410, I believe... I'm not going to get cocky, but I believe I'll start connecting a little more. Two on the left that I'm missing out on. We got to go. Yo, Eurasians. Oh, keep coming. Five, what? Five pack of Eurasians. Yeah. That's cool. They don't like to Oh, go right out front, right out front. More Eurasians. Oh, go down. He's dead. No. 
Dude, I smoked him. Com one. <laughs> completely just, dude, tore him up. I he did not go down. Why? Why, why, why? Okay, I understand the 410. Man, I remember snow goose hunting with this thing and the TSS loads were hammers. I can't believe there's that much of a difference. Just down to bird right here. I don't know if he's all the way dead. Heel, Fred, heel. Just downed one right here. He landed. He must be dead. There he is. Ah! Ah, <laughs> uh, he wasn't that dead. My goodness. It's 410. I've never had this just much trouble uh, getting on target. You know, connecting with this 410. I don't... <sighs> Gotta get learnt back up on her, I guess. Oof. Still pretty long. 12 gauge, I mean, 12 shit. 12 gauge, I'd have been like, done. Yeah. Don't mind if I do. One coming from the left. Come on, two, three coming from the left. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Come on, buddy. Bring me that Eurasian. You got a collar dove in your mouth, boy. Let me see it. There we go. That one's gonna eat real good, Frederick. Oh yeah, that's a good boy. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, goodness. Oh, I missed. Well, second bird down for Bob of the day, my goodness. We're gonna start whittling here. I can feel it, I can feel it. If they decoy that good, I think I can, I think I can get somewhere. Old Frederick though, that dude right there, he is doing amazing. I'm so proud of him, not breaking at all. Gee, many Christmas. That's a lot of dove. That's a lot of dove. I hope you guys can see that. My goodness. And they 150 all. 150 is not an exaggeration by Yeah, 150. Of that, that's every bit of 200 birds, and they all hate us. Yeah. <laughs> I, I think Fred stinks or something. Something, <laughs> man. You need to brush your teeth or what, dude? Everywhere. Oh, look at these dove. Holy smokes. Good boy here. Well, this is the one that I just missed, and then. Jordan cleaned up for me. Here you go. Oh, thank you. Wow, there's a lot of dove out here, dude. They just got up all at once. Oh, yep, yeah, there we go. Move right okay, we're all right. I don't have to say it. I, I'm about ready to go to the truck and get my 12 gauge. I ain't gonna lie. Well, I do not know how I just missed that pigeon. Here you go, Fred, here. Let me have it. Nope. Nope. Fetch it up. Fetch it. Fetch. Set. No, up here. Fetch it up. Fetch. Hold. <laughs> he's like, Dad, what do you want me to do here? Man, I don't know how I missed him, dude. He's yours. Here you go. Many thanks. Don't know how I missed him. No idea. <laughs> Friend. There we go. We got one down, boys. Whoo, third of the day. It's taking a little bit. Good boy here. Fred's doing great, not breaking. Third one down. There we go. Come on, buddy. Let's go. Heel. Give. Hi, bird. There we go, third one of the day. We got two morning dove down and one Eurasian collar dove down. There we go. It's hard with one shot, guys. Uh, just having one shot and having to make it count, boy, it's hard. For one thing, having only one shot, you anticipate it so much. You know you only have one. Having two backups, it's, it gives it, it gives yourself a lot of extra confidence having two backup shells, you know. But having only one, it's tough. It's tough. I, uh, I, uh, dare y'all to get out there and try it. Only put one in your gun at all times, even if it's a 12 gauge, try it. It'll make you a better shooter. Well, there we go. Good boy here. Let's go. 
I don't know if I got that on shot cam or not. Probably not. Here. Here, Fred. But that bird did it really close to the mojo. That was nice. Here, buddy. He's slowing down in these uh, thick sunflower stalks now. Good. Sit. Good. Drop. My bird. There we go. Number four. If they decoy like that, I'm confident that I can. I don't think I'm going to limit out today, but might get close. Well, I just downed heel. Heel. Right here. Here. Heel. Sit. Fred. Just down to bird. Fred didn't see it go down. See if he can find it. That's farther than that, dude. Keep working. Oh, 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 you hurt your leg, dude? What's wrong? Come here, come here, Fred. It's your paw. He's favoring this paw. What happened? Oh, you had a big sticker in there, buddy. All right, let's go find that bird. Come on, come on, let's go find that bird. Good. <laughs> That's a good dog. Set, set, drop my bird. There we go. Like I said, I'm really working with Frederick. Oh, look at those three out front. I do not have a shell in. Well, it looks like it's picking up. Five birds on the board. There we go, there we go. Yeah, buddy, number six. Oh, you're almost to it, Fred. Fred, dead bird. Oh, you're right there, buddy. There you go, there you go. There he got it. Yeah. <laughs> Number six on the ground. Decoyed really good. Seems like uh, with the 410, they either have to decoy, you know, belly towards me or just be the right passing shot at about 20 yards, and that's it. Here. Sit. Drop. There we go. Number six. I know I've probably said it a million times in this video already, but I cannot describe how nice it is to have Fred not breaking this year. Oh my goodness. Believe me, I read all your guys' comments, and last year it was brutal having Fred break. And I would try to leash him, leash him up in the A-frame, and then he'd wreck the A-frame. Uh, it was really worth uh, just letting him go to training with Charlie. If you guys are looking for a good dog trainer, hit up Charlie Seward uh, at Sand Hill Retrievers. He's in the same town as me. Um, I will link his information down in the description below. He has done an amazing job with Frederick. Thank you, Charlie. Thank you. If you need some dog training, uh, get a hold of him. If you want to buy a puppy that started, if you, if, if there are all kinds of options, get a hold of him. Heck yeah. Number seven down, Fred is on it. Yes, 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 that was a long shot. That was a long shot indeed for the 410. That passing shot right there, left to right, that is my shot. I feel very confident whenever I try those shots. Drink, here, drink, here you go, here you go. Oh, that's a, oh, sorry buddy, here, another drink. Oh, that's real good, isn't it, oh yeah. Oh, yeah, that's good. Okay. Is that good stuff, buddy? Well, I'm at seven. Nice. Ay, 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 number eight. Good boy, Fred. He, God, I'm loving it. They're decoying a lot better now that the uh, sun's starting to set. That, Come on, buddy. That your confidence yeah, I, my, my shot's way better already. Come on. It took all day to get it there, but come on, buddy. Set, set, drop. Good boy. No band. If you shot a band, <laughs> I would steal that bird and be like, I don't know what you're talking about. It turned into WWE out here real <laughs> quick. Number eight for the 410. And uh, Fred, I think I'm way more excited. I'm honestly way more excited consistently. Sit, sit on Fred because I'll, I'll shoot. He'll watch the bird. He'll watch the bird get shot, go down, and he's steady. Man, I'm loving it. Sit, sit. It's a good dog. This is what I've been after right here, buddy. 
Be like, Where's the hat? What's uh? What do you got? What do you uh, have right there, sir? Like the last of my goose jerky from last from, season. From last season. Is that some half? It is some half. Oh, <laughs> a lot of you don't know what half is, but uh, it's half. Just half. It's hot. Just means hot. Oh, but we're getting ready to uh, clean birds. I didn't know this hat did this. I didn't know it buttoned up like this. Kind of like a cowboy hat now. <laughs> oh, well, hi there, Freddy Rico. Old Fred, he had fun on this one. This one was a good one. It was good to get Fred back out there. Um, lately, guys, to me, it's not about what gun I'm using, what situation it is. It's all about Fred, man. I'm so proud of him. He's my buddy. He goes everywhere I do. And this year, he's sharp. Much sharper than last year. Shot eight birds. Didn't limit out. Uh, I thought I would limit out because there were so many birds, but it just took me so many shells to get down eight birds. I was not on my game like usual. Looking back at the shot cam, um, I was behind a lot of birds. I was either under them or behind them, and I don't know why. Now, one reason I do know why is because, like I said, 11, 11 16 ounce shells is what those were for that 410. I know I'm making up excuses, but I just wasn't leading them enough. So if they weren't at 20 yards, I wasn't hitting them. But you live and you learn. I feel like I did decent. But like I said, this hunt was all about Frederick. If you guys like the dove hunts, I need you guys to drop a comment down below. Let me know what the next one you want me to do. Dove season is going to be coming to an end once we start having these cold fronts come, y'all. So while they're here, let me know. Do you guys want me to do a 20 gauge pump? I wouldn't mind doing that next. Again, drop a comment down below and let me know. If you guys like this video, just smash a thumbs up button. That's the least that y'all could do. But I'm going to go in the lodge here. You guys can't see anything. I don't want them to see anything. You can't see anything here. No peekaboo. No peeking. No peekaboo. What have you been in here doing, man? Sorry, I'm so close to you. I don't want them to see the lodge. I am the middle. My middle name is Cheap Labor. <laughs> Cheap Labor. <laughs> yep, I'm. I'm not letting you guys see the lodge because you guys have to see. You guys just have to wait till the big reveal of the lodge. Um, I've been telling you guys because a lot of time, a lot of work. A lot of blood, sweat, and tears have been going into this thing, and Dad's been here helping me. He has been mopping and cleaning these floors. But you guys can't see anything just yet. Stay tuned for the big Lodge Reveal video. It's going to be awesome. I cannot wait to share it with you all. Uh, a while back, I decided to cut off the Lodge vids because we were at that point. Uh, to, for me just to wait to show you guys till it was finished. So, it came out way better than uh, I was originally expecting it to, but you just have to wait for the video. But other than the lodge video, uh, I got two more teal hunts coming y'all's way for certain. Uh, a couple more public hunts coming. A lot of exciting stuff. If you're a waterfowl hunter and you haven't subscribed yet, I just checked and we're at like 43% of y'all that have not subscribed. You guys got to because we're coming at you every other day. That's my upload schedule. Every other day, with something shotgun, waterfowl, wing shooting related. Whether it's dove, pigeon, ducks, geese, whatever. The Lodge, Frederick. A lot is coming down the pipe, y'all. But I wanna thank y'all for being here, first and foremost. If it wasn't for y'all being here, I wouldn't be able to make this my job. I, I wouldn't be able to build this lodge and, and make my dreams come true. Thank y'all, I, I really push you guys. Push yourself, get out there. Expect more of yourself every day. Get off your tushy. Get going. Get stuff done. Make goals for yourself and accomplish them. And again, if you have good ideas that you want to try something, go try it. If you, if you don't like it, at least you can say you tried. What I'm getting at, guys, is life is way too short not to think... How do I put this? To think that you can't do stuff. Get out there, and I guarantee you... With effort and more effort and just repetitive effort, your dreams can come true no matter what you want to do. And I do mean that from the bottom of my heart because I appreciate y'all and, and y'all are part of my family. And uh, I just want to say again, thank you all for being here. There's a lot of other places you could be, 
but when you guys are here it makes me feel pretty darn special but until next time I've been getting laid back, baby, you should know that I don't need your criticism, pessimism I've been keeping it on the DL, got a girl that keeps it real